Hello everyone, my name is Sandra and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm sharing this cute little panda card that I created with products from Craft and Desert Divas. I'm using the I Can't Even Panda that is a digital download from Craft and Desert Divas. I printed him out on some Nina Solar White cardstock and here you can see that I'm just masking off the bottom. I wanted the panda to have a bed to lie on and I'm checking out which side of my Sorted Shapes 1 stencil to use for the background. I created a mask beforehand and fussy cut it out and here I'm just putting it down, getting ready to do some ink blending. The ink colors that I'm gonna be using today are Cracked Pistachio, Hickory Smoke, and Squeeze Lemonade and they're all Distress Oxide inks. Now my video um, camera shut off while I was doing my ink blending so you're not going to see the whole process here but anyway I just started off by putting some cracked pistachio on the background and I'm just kind of blending it out not really caring how well it blends because I know that I'm going to be putting that stencil over top So I'm getting my stencil ready. Now this Sorted Shape 1 stencil has four different designs that you can choose from. I chose the chevron pattern just because it looked most like some wallpaper to me. And I'm taping it off here. I'm getting ready to do more ink blending and here it's all done. At this point, I'm getting ready to color my images. I'm using Copic markers and I'm going to let some music play while I color, but I'll have all the colors I used listed in the description box below.
that my image is all colored up, I'm just adding a few details with my white jelly roll pen. I'm just adding a few polka dots on the pillowcase and then a few highlights here and there on the panda himself. Once I'm finished with that, then I'm going to just take a black marker. I think this is an EK Success marker. And I'm just going to go ahead and outline my image since it didn't seem as bold as if I had inked it with some Memento ink. So I'm just going around the whole image just to darken up those lines to give it more definition. And also the Distress Oxide ink went over like the little Z's for his sleeping um, pattern there. <laughs> I wanted to make sure that those were seen also. He's such a cute image. It just reminds me of my daughter, actually. So now I'm taking the crazy stitched rectangle dies that you can get from Craft and Desert Divas, and I'm gonna go ahead and cut my image out. I'm just gonna tape it down, and then I'm gonna run it through my big shot. And then I'm getting my card base ready. This is just a regular A2 sized card base. And I'm going to score it with my bone folder and go ahead and fold it up and give it a nice crease. It's taken me a few moments. I think I was a little off whenever I scored this card base. So I'm gonna, just gonna keep this as a one layer card. I, the image is just too cute by itself. And here you can see my ATG gun had run out, so I'm just grabbing some Tombow um, permanent adhesive and adding it to my card. So this completes my card for today. All the products I used will be listed in the description box below. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. You can find more details on my blog at Crafted Bliss Studio. Thanks for watching.